How to apply for Medicare. Ryan Malloy with TheSeniorList.com, helping you understand the ins, the outs, the costs, and the coverage of Medicare. Applying for Medicare is a relatively simple process, possibly the most straightforward part of Medicare altogether, but there are a few situations that affect how you do it. Let's start with the easiest. Some people get Medicare Parts A and B automatically. When you apply for retirement or disability benefits from Social Security or the RRB board, this also serves as your Medicare application. Once you're eligible for Medicare at age 65, you'll automatically get Parts A and B coverage. For people who want to delay their benefits until after 65, you'll want to complete a separate application during your initial enrollment period, that is the three months before and after you turn 65. If you enroll before your birthday, coverage will begin on the first day of your birth month. If you enroll after your birthday, coverage begins on the first month after your application is processed. To apply, you have three options online, over the phone, or in person at your local Social Security office. Regardless of the method you choose, you'll need your Social Security number, birth information, start and end dates for any group coverage, and if relevant, any Medicaid information. To learn more about Medicare enrollment and the different parts of Medicare, give us a follow and check us out at theseniorlist.com.